So, people have been asking me how to fade in and out of voice effects in Audacity. To my knowledge, the only way to do this is to use the crossfade effect. And here's how to do it. First, you need an unedited audio clip. Once you've got that, select the second half of your clip, around the point where you want to start fading. Copy-paste it onto the second track by pressing Ctrl-C on your keyboard, clicking below your first track, and pressing Ctrl-V. Use your Time Shift tool, which is located right here, to line up the tracks so the audio matches up. Delete most of the shared area of your first clip, except for the part that you want to fade. Then you need to apply your effect to whichever side you want to have it. For this video, we're just going to lower the pitch because it's going to be really obvious. Once that's applied, we're going to select the remaining area shared between the two tracks. Make sure to select both tracks by holding down Shift. Once you've got them both selected, go to Effects, and then scroll all the way down to Crossfade Tracks, right here. The default setting should work fine for this demonstration, so we're going to go ahead and apply it. But feel free to tamper with this if you're unhappy with how it sounds. Now that we're done, let's play it back. The Halo 5 Magnum can pop the shields of a fully shielded opponent in only 4 shots, and kill in 5 if it lands a headshot. Personally, I find this easier to do in just about any other program, but unlike Audacity, they aren't free. That being said, I've always felt like there should be an easier way to do this, so if you know of any other way, please let me know in the comments section and I'll make an updated video. Otherwise, that's it for this video, and I'll see you again next time.